curlers. I make curlers. There's somebody out there that's freaking out right now because they can't stand the idea of something so old-fashioned to curl one's hair. No, you would be surprised how many people get upset over the fact that I use curlers instead of a curling iron. <laughs> so, a very nice person bought me something off of my Amazon wish list. Um, and I was going to wait until tomorrow, but I'm impatient and I want to open it now. And I decided I wanted to do my first official unenveloping for my first official bought anonymously item. And you know what? I've streamed on Twitch and curlers. I've put curlers in my hair while streaming, live streaming with Count Jacula. So why not an envelope in curlers? Um, let's get this party started, shall we? Apparently I should have used scissors. In fact, that's what I'm going to do. Where are my scissors? See, there's a hole behind the seat. I just dropped my mirror. And there's a hole behind the scenes thing. Yes, I own a mirror. Isn't that shocking? A fat woman owning a mirror. There's so many behind the scenes things that you will never see. Ooh. Ooh. What is it? What is it? actually something for Molly. Oh, thank you. Okay. Oh, I know. Merry Christmas. Please do another Loki singing video. It was the best. If I can think of another song for Loki, I will. There's um, over on Instagram, I did a bunch of little short videos where I did theme songs for um, various people. Um, and uh, like Captain America, there's this old song from the 1940s uh, called He's 1A in the Army and He's A1 in My Heart. I think that's very Captain America, you know. I, I, I'm sorry, You're So Vain fits Loki so well. Molly, this is actually for you. This is actually for you, Molly. Look, she's got a nice little reflective dog collar. Yay! Because I will tell you, that dog is so dark in color that when I'm in the hallway and the lights are out, I have tripped over her because I didn't know she was there. So I really wanted a reflective dog collar for her. So thank you so much. And I promise if I can... Think of another song for Loki, but I mean, you're so vain fits him so well. I, when even, even North mythology wise, Norse mythology, however, the, I am having trouble speaking because I am so overwhelmed by your generosity. Um, so there, there's a lyric in you're so vain where, you know, I, I hear you went up to Saratoga and your horse naturally won. And in North uh, Norse mythology. There's this whole myth where this giant offered to build a wall around Asgard and said, but if I do it, you have to let me marry Freya. And at first everybody is like, no, we don't want you to marry Freya. We don't want some giant marrying our most beautiful woman. And Loki's like, no, no, let him do it. Let him do it. And this giant had this stallion who did all the hauling for him. And so the giant starts building a wall and the agreement was, okay, well, if you build the wall in this many days, we'll let you marry Freya. And um, then the giant gets really close to finishing the wall and they're like, Loki, what are we going to do? We don't want him to marry Freya. And Loki's like, keep calm, keep calm. I'll take care of it. And Loki, who is gender fluid, turned himself into a mare and ran past the stallion and they went off into the woods, right? And so the giant didn't finish the wall in time. The giant did eventually finish the wall, but he didn't finish it in time, so he didn't get to marry Freya. But um, not long after, Loki gave birth to an eight-legged colt. 
um, whose name I can't pronounce. So that lyric alone definitely fits Loki. But um, again, thank you so much. Um, <laughs> you know, I, I, I really appreciate it. So this is, this is my first official unenveloping and this will help me see Molly in the dark and I would put it on her right now, except, um, <coughs> uh, you know, <coughs> oh, I might as well just say it. I didn't put any pants on when I was filming this. <laughs>